Last week, LaSalle College Director of Athletics Christy Walter broke the news that the school plans on building a LaSalle College Athletics Hall of Fame. Over the weekend, I caught up with Christy to discuss what this means for past and future athletes and coaches who represent the Lasers. Since joining the NCAA in 1998, LaSalle College has won 16 NCAA tournaments. For Christy Walter, the school's director of athletics, now seems as good a time as ever to establish its own Hall of Fame. We've actually been talking about it for a few years and we've just come to the decision that it's, it's time for it now. So we became a member of the NCAA in 1998. Uh, so it's going on 20 years now that we've been an actual member, or an official member of the NCAA and just thought it was time. Christy hopes having a Hall of Fame will not only help with sell on its past, but achieve its future goals as well. I think that it helps the, in terms of future and recruiting to kind of set that foundation and show people the level of excellence that we have, um, that we have had some All-American players and we've won 20 conference championships and this would kind of hopefully give them a goal to reach for to want to be part of the F Hall of Fame and part of the excellence of the program. As for who might be in LaSalle's inaugural Hall of Fame class, Christie's keeping that information close to the vest. We really want to make sure that it's, they've attained a high level of, of achievement. It's, we don't want it to be, you know, anybody can get in. So we do have a selection process and uh, benchmarks we're looking at. But I don't, I'm not going to share that right now. <laughs> in early June, Christy will let the inductees know they were selected. I guess we'll have to wait until then to find out who's in. From LaSalle College, Bobby Kravitsky, New TV.